Bye, friends. Welcome to the beautiful town of Gananoque, Ontario. As our drone takes flight, let's explore the charm and beauty that make this place so special. Below us lies a town steeped in history, with stories waiting to be discovered around every corner. From its quaint streets to its picturesque waterfront, Gananoque is a treasure trove of sights and experiences. Take a moment to admire the historic architecture that lines the streets, each building a testament to the town's rich heritage. And let's not forget about the stunning waterfront. With its marinas, boat tours, and scenic views of the Thousand Islands, it's no wonder Gananoque is known as the gateway to the islands. Welcome to St. Andrew's Presbyterian Church, a cherished landmark in Gananoque, Ontario. The story of this church dates back to 1837 when Gananoque's Presbyterian community gathered for worship in small frame buildings. Over time, as the congregation grew, the need for a larger space became evident. Thanks to the generosity of the Honorable John MacDonald, land was donated at the corner of Sydenham and Stone Streets for the construction of a new church. In 1855, St. Andrew's Presbyterian Church opened its doors, showcasing a contemporary-styled sandstone building adorned with the splendid rose window, a gift from the Clark Thread Company of Scotland. Over the years, the church continued to evolve and expand. In 1871, a church hall, interior gallery, and choir loft were added, followed by the installation of an organ in 1874. The church saw further enhancements in 1887 with the completion of northern and southern wings and a chancel, and the introduction of electricity in 1892. Throughout its history, St. Andrew's has been more than just a place of worship. It has been a hub of community activity, offering meeting space for various groups and organizations. For over 30 years, the local Alcoholics Anonymous chapter has found support here, alongside the Gananoque Cooperative Nursery School, music and drama groups, yoga classes, and even a local brownie unit. 
Today, St. Andrews continues to honor its rich heritage while embracing the needs of the 21st century. With a commitment to maintaining, updating, and ensuring accessibility for all, the church remains a vital part of the community, serving as a beacon of faith, fellowship, and service for generations to come. Welcome to Grace United Church, a breathtaking site nestled in the heart of Gananoque, Ontario. As our drone takes flight, let's embark on a journey through history and beauty. Gaze upon the towering spire and the elegant facade adorned with beautiful stones, making this church a true gem in the town's skyline. But it's not just about its exterior, the beauty within shines just as brightly. Established in 1836 as a Wesleyan Methodist congregation, Grace United Church has stood the test of time, evolving with each passing era. From its humble beginnings as a wooden church to the magnificent stone structure built in 1871, every corner exudes charm and history. Stained glass windows adorn the sanctuary, each one a masterpiece of color and light, casting a warm glow on all who enter. Through the years, Grace United Church has been a beacon of faith and community. From its days as Grace Methodist Church after the Union in 1884 to its current form as Grace United Church since 1925, it has been a place of solace and celebration for generations. In 1979, tragedy struck when fire engulfed the church, but from the ashes rose a renewed spirit of resilience. In 1981, Grace United Church officially reopened its doors, stronger than ever, a testament to the unwavering faith of its congregation. As the drone glides gracefully over the city, let's take a moment to appreciate one of its architectural gems, St. John the Evangelist Catholic Church. This stunning church, nestled in the heart of Gananoque, 
has a rich history dating back to the late 19th century. Designed by the talented Joseph Connolly, it stands as a testament to Canada's architectural heritage. But the story of St. John's goes even further back. The parish was founded in 1846, during a time of great migration and change. The original church, built in 1847, witnessed the influx of Irish immigrants fleeing the Great Famine, seeking hope and refuge in a new land. Over the years, St. John's has been more than just a place of worship. It's been a beacon of community, offering support, education, and cultural enrichment. From its early days to the present, it has played a vital role in the lives of Gananoque residents. As our drone soars higher, you can admire the intricate details of St. John's architecture. Crafted from limestone quarried from nearby Howe Island, its Romanesque revival style captures the essence of a bygone era. From its semicircular arches to its multi-scalloped capitals, every aspect of St. John's design tells a story of faith and craftsmanship. And as we gaze upon its timeless beauty, we're reminded of the enduring spirit of this historic church and the community it serves. Let's take a journey through one of Gananukwe's most iconic landmarks, the Town Hall. But before we delve into the present, let's rewind to the past. It all began in 1817 when John MacDonald arrived from New York to join his brother Charles. Together, they built a thriving business empire that included lumbering, a general store, mills, and more. In 1831, John built the MacDonald House, a stately mansion where he and his family resided. Fast forward to today, and this historic building serves as the Town Hall, a hub of community activity and governance. But the Town Hall isn't just a relic of the past, it's a living, breathing testament to Gananoque's enduring spirit. Over the years, it has adapted to serve the needs of the community, from courtrooms to council meetings and everything in between. In 1977 to 1979, the Town Hall underwent major renovations and restorations, breathing new life into its historic halls. Today, it stands as a symbol of civic pride, a reminder of the vision and generosity of the MacDonald family. From its grand architecture to its storied past, this iconic landmark will continue to inspire generations to come.
Thanks for watching.